tonight telling you about a chance for those who want to save the North Woods at Crown Hill Cemetery. RTV 6's Derek Thomas reporting the Department of Veterans Affairs is set to turn it into a cemetery that would handle only cremated remains. This is a 14.75 acre parcel that the Department of Veterans Affairs purchased from Crown Hill Cemetery. Environmentalists don't want this forest destroyed. In this 380 page book, published about Crown Hill, it says specifically, these woods are special. In this old world forest, there are 47 species of native trees. You see that giant tree trunk in there? That's a bur oak that's hundreds of years old. Jeff Stand of the Indiana Forest Alliance is passionate about the preservation of this wooded wonderland. It would be a tragedy to wipe out the only old growth forest the only pre-settlement forest left in inner city Indianapolis and one of a handful you can count in the whole state to, to put a cemetery here when you could honor the veterans by putting their, their, their cemetery next to this and naming that forest after the veterans. That suggestion so far has not resonated. These are artist renderings of what the veteran cemetery for cremated remains would look like but the VA is well aware that there is considerable dissent. We're moving forward with the plan right now, though, because, because of the concerns, we're still talking to the community, and we're, and we're looking at, at and evaluating, you know, where, where, which trees can be saved, if they're healthy trees, which trees can be saved, and which can be incorporated into the design. 500 or more years old is what they're saying. That is not what the environmentalists who cherish this forest want to hear. Environmentalists know it will be an uphill battle, but they will be at the public meeting beginning at 7 o'clock at the Indiana War Memorial. Derek Thomas, RTV6.